All right, settle down. Hey, McVisson. I only got two hours. It's my brother's coffee shop. I mean, I'm, I'm Captain Locke. Well, my name's Roxford Loxley. Uh, they call me Loose Leaf Loxley. Uh, no Socks Loxley. Uh, rock my socks off. Lock my socks off. Captain Sleazy. Uh, lock and Roll. Rock and Loxley. My real name's Jeff. All right, all right, Cap, get off my ass. Really all right, serious. listen. You gotta take a moment of silence today. Officer Jerry Jarvis had this vinyl pad last week. Now, we all know he had bad habits, high cholesterol, terrible heart problems, which is why it was a surprise to all of us when he died in a car crash. So let's take a moment of silence while I think of the next thing to say. All right, you would have wanted us to speed that up, so we'd be getting some fresh meat around the office, which is why I brought a meat platter. Wow, that, that looks disgusting. What is that, locks? Is that from your bagel earlier, Cap? I don't Cap. know, some guy handed that to me on the street. It's cat food, Cap. It's supposed to be fresh meat. Yeah, I guess. Any, all right, don't eat it. Anyway. It's disgusting. Which brings me to my next point. A little disappointing, Cap. We're going to be getting a new member around the office today. Oh. A, new, a new member of the tap division, all right? Oh. To replace Jerry Jarvins in the years of service that he gave us. Jerry Jarvins cannot be replaced. Cap. No, never. But we're going to replace him. Well, you know. Well, yeah, we... Oh, God. And apparently, they could be coming here right now. Oh, I thought they'd walk in now. Oh. There's no one there. Oh wait, who the hell's that? Hey, who the hell are you? We're closed. Get out of here, you help inspector hey, trick. Is this the tap division? I oh god! I got you, I got you. Come on. Come on. Uh, uh, Cap, do something. Uh, stop. Uh, isn't this the tap division? Yeah, who the hell yes. are you? Who are you? Who are you? I'm the new recruit. You know, this guy looks ridiculous. I mean, yeah, if you want to stay, you gotta change your outfit. Yeah. I mean, look at his outfit. He looks. What, what, are, you, what are you wearing? A t shirt and pants? Yeah. Well, like <laughs> pants? A, like a pants. A Catholic schoolboy, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, welcome serious. to the tap division. Yeah, welcome to the tap division. We'll get you a uniform. Let's get him a uniform. Yeah. Why am I in the tap division? Let's just leave that as a mystery. So, what do I do? I just. I talk to the camera or I talk to him? Him? My name uh, is uh, it's, uh, Ralph McPherson. I've been uh, part of this TAP division for seven years now. Originally, I was part of the NYPD. Got busted drinking on the job while driving. Uh, Hell yeah, you did. Yeah, I did. Um, for the most part, got my stuff under the control. And I'm not really even completely sure what we're talking about from the beginning because I get nervous around candles, candles, but cameras. <laughs> uh, but I am also hammered right now. So. Uh, Hey, I'm uh, Hank Hendricks, from Tap Division. So, uh, you know, I've, I've always loved dancing, tapping. Uh, I knew for sure I wanted to do that. However, I've never been that good. So, I, you know, let's go ahead and say I couldn't go pro. I grew up watching a lot of Law & Order SVU with my mother. Um, however, murders and rapists actually kind of scare me. So I didn't want to be a, a real cop. Mix that all together, and I found my home in the tap division. I really couldn't be happy about it. Uh, the shorts, the uniform, I feel like I can do anything when I come into work here. Oh, oh! Oh boy, I gotta get used to having a camera crew around. I wonder what they're gonna think. We'll see. Well, look at you! Now you don't look like an idiot anymore. Oh, thanks, not bad. Hey, hey, get your things off my desk, all right? Nothing goes on my desk. Yeah, take it off. Nothing goes on my desk. Except that, and that phone, and that coffee mug, and that bag of munchkins that Hendrick's help. Okay, uh, yeah. Okay, uh, so is this, uh, really our office? Uh, this is our office, yeah. It's a really, really cozy place. Uh, it's Captain's Brothers Restaurant. He seems like a really nice guy. I've never met him, but he's really nice to be letting us use his, his restaurant every morning, and we kind of make a mess, and we leave it, and you know, I mean, you know, he puts in about 18 hours a day, 
uh, cleans it up real nice, makes it look real good. Uh, he's probably here real late till around like 2.30 at night. He dips out around 2.45. I pop by, get the key under the mat, put the key in the lock, open the door, let the tap division in, and we got, voila, the best tap division meeting spot possible. Wait, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm Billy Earnhardt. I just got here 10 minutes ago. Barry Sternglosh. No, no, Billy Earnhardt. All right, listen, Sternglosh. I'm uh, Billy Earnhardt. I'm the new recruit. Sternglosh. Uh, stop. <laughs> I'm Billy Earnhardt. Uh, yep, I'm the new recruit. Sternglosh. Uh, I mean, I'm from Minnesota. You know, Duluth. Great town, you know. Uh, saw an ad on Craigslist for the tap division, and I thought, you know, anything that I can do to get out of Duluth <laughs> That's probably gonna be a good thing, you know? Because it was either that or work my father's goat cheese farm. And you know, I don't even like goat cheese. Tell them about the government funded. Oh yeah, the government funded. Yeah. That's, oh. actually, that's my favorite. One day, me, McPherson, and Captain, we were out on the town. But yeah, we uh, went down an alley and I saw, you know, we saw a dead, dead body. I don't know, McPherson took us out for drinks, so I don't remember that well. It's always wild when McPherson's fan. Okay, but, but next to that was a big, big bag of cash. That's, yeah, that big bag, bag of cash. That, that big awesome. bag of cash was, was incredible. Government funding, right there. That's our government funding. I mean, if you want to ask if we got government funding, we got government funding. We had it for a few years. Big bag of cash. Uh, I was going to ask, you know, uh, does someone know about salary or like pay? Uh, that's fine. We all know that some of our biggest priorities uh, taking down the ice cream bandit and, you know, cracking down on public urination. But the top priority is Operation Find My Car Keys. Are those your car keys? Right there? Hey, rookie. Shut up. But yes, that's them. So congratulations on your first crack case. Third block. Not bad, third block. Not bad. Hey, McPherson, where are you? You gotta clap with us. What are you doing over there? Wake up, McPherson. Better not be spiking a drink. Is that my coffee mug? McPherson, is that my coffee mug? That's not your coffee mug. That's definitely my coffee mug. Give me my coffee mug. Alright, we'll take it back. See if you can take it, huh? Jesus, Hendrix! McPherson, you're drinking on the job again. I take mean, a day off. Listen, I do what I do. I get my job done. I am who I am. Take a day Have off. He spit all over me. Why don't you? I remember my first beer. Cassie's he's off the wagon. Hey, hey! Shut up. Oh, oh, hold on, Jay. What's Wait that? Wait a minute. What's that? Candy store robber. Uh, 24th to 24th. Come on, let's, let's, let's go. go. Let's go. Let's get it. I think they got it. They got it, Cassie. Let's get some donuts back inside. Go! Go! Stop fighting! Go! Go! That's why this job's dangerous. Ah. Yeah, shake it off. Now we're at a red light. This is... This is the worst part about being in the tap division. Is we don't have sirens. We just gotta wait at red lights like every other Joe Schmo. Make a left turn, ass Oh, you know, you really shouldn't uh, say those words, you know, like uh, swears. Shut the f up. Ah, oh, wait, 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 wait. We gotta make a pit stop. What? Yeah, I, I can't. No, the I, guy's gonna get away. I can't get the criminal on an empty stomach. We gotta go to Duncan. Well, no, in Minnesota, when we like, uh, you know, Krispy Kreme. Okay, Krispy Kreme's good, but you know what? You're really lucky that McPherson and Captain aren't here because if they were, that'd be a strike. Cat, can we catch him? Can we catch him, Cat? Hey, yeah, well, we eat donuts. You know, send the boys out on their mission and uh, they come back. We reap the rewards, am I right? What the hell did you say? And you know what? You don't want three strikes. What happens when you get to three strikes? Actually, I mean, no one's really ever asked that, so I'm not, I'm not sure what happens. But, you know, three strikes is never good. So, oh yeah, that's know. you know. Geez. Back in Minnesota at the goat cheese farm, we used to have to sleep outside with the goats if we got three strikes. 
use them as a pillow. Okay, well, you know, no matter what, I can guarantee it's not that bad because I don't think anything's as bad as Minnesota. Minnesota. That's true. Did you get a Boston cream? Oh no, I only got jelly donuts. Okay, <laughs> that's what we can do now. Let's just get out of this spot. I'm all turned around. We're, we're, we need to get 24th and 24th. Can you, uh, I left my phone. Can you pull up GPS on yours? Come on. What? No, no. I don't have a smartphone. Well, how did you even get to the office today? Like, how, how'd you, how do you get around? With the map. 24th and 24th, make it happen, let's go. I can't see the road now. There we go. That's a subway map, Sternbosch. Right, you know what? I'm just gonna trust my instincts on this one. Well, I don't I'm, know. I'm going I thought... straight. No. no. No, no. You were supposed to go left. Here's the thing, rookie. This is a one-way street. Welcome to New York. So... Okay. Oh. Oh. Ah! Is he dead? I don't know. I don't know how to check a pulse. I just saw it on Grey's Anatomy. That's all. I don't. I don't know what I'm doing, Stanford. He's dead. No. Ah, oh, fuck. What are we gonna do, Sternbosch? Oh, I don't know. You know what? I'll tell you what we're oh, gonna do, oh. Sternbosch. Okay? We're gonna check his wallet for government funding. Okay? And then we're gonna we're gonna take the body and we're gonna dispose of it in the water in the Hudson. Because that's the only choice we have, Sternbosch. What about the camera crew? What's that in his pocket? Come on, check. <laughs> it's the criminal! It's we, the criminal! We only killed a criminal! Then it doesn't matter! Then they don't matter at all! It doesn't matter! <laughs> Methods may be unorthodox, but damn it, you get the job done. No. Here's the Stern Blush. Let's all say his name. Stern Blush. Stern Blush. Stern Blush. Stern Blush. Stern Blush. Nobody cares, rookie. Yeah, Stern Blush.